channel. This is Laura. I hope you are having a wonderful day. Thank you for stopping by today and spending time with me. Today what I'm going to share with you is how I make some very easy, very inexpensive, and very quick pizza pockets. They're little bite-sized appetizers filled with pepperoni, mozzarella cheese, and cream cheese. And they're very crispy on the outside using some egg roll skins. I hope you enjoy the recipe and if you do, please give the video a thumbs up. Leave a comment down below that really helps out the channel. If you are new here, I really would appreciate it if you would consider hitting that subscribe button and turning on that notification bell so you'll never miss an episode. Okay guys, let's go ahead and get started. Okay, we're going to start off today's recipe. I have a cookie sheet with some parchment paper. I have some mozzarella cheese. I have some cream cheese. I have some egg roll skins. And I have these pepperoni minis that you can use for salads or pastas. And then we just have a little bit of Italian seasoning, salt and pepper. And that's for the filling for these pizza pockets. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna add our cream cheese to our mozzarella cheese. We're gonna mix this up. You need to make sure that the cream cheese is at room temperature so that you can smash it up and get it well mixed in here. Okay, so we're just gonna add our salt and pepper, not too much. Salt. pepper and some Italian seasoning. And then we're going to add in our pepperoni, our mini pepperoni. Just make sure that they're separated. Sometimes they, they tend to stick. So you want to get your hands in there and separate them. Okay, so we're going to give this a good mix, get it all incorporated. Now what we're going to do is I uncovered the egg roll skins. Now what you do is you take one, make sure you keep them covered so they don't dry up on you. Cut them in half and then just cut them in half again. These are going to make really cute little pizza pockets. I already have a stack over here. We're going to keep these covered so that they don't start cracking on us. So I have a whole bunch right there. And what you do is you take your filling, you can do a few of these at a time if you want. It takes about a teaspoon of filling per pocket. Okay, you put it in the center. If you want to add a little bit more, you can. And then you take your water, dip your finger in, and just go around. And then we're going to fold over one side, fold over the other side, press the side, and then the other side. So this is what you have. And then you just start putting them in your cookie tray over there. It's a little time consuming, but you know, they are well worth it. I think they have a lot of flavor and they really look cute for the kids or... You can put this on a, you know, serve as an appetizer or just have it on a football day or just like that. And just keep going. Okay, so this is what we have and I'm just going to continue to do these. And I'm going to pop y'all over to the stove and we will start to fry them. Alrighty, we are back at the stove. I have my little tray pizza pockets there. The temperature should be at around 350, 340 or so. Just a few minutes on each side. And then just flip them over after about two minutes. They start getting this golden brown color. Just take them out, put them on the rack, on the cooling rack. Don't bite into them right away because they're going to be piping hot. You'll burn your mouth. Okay, 
Okay, guys, that's it. I'm going to pop y'all back to the counter. We're going to let these cool for a little bit. Oops. Okay, everybody, that was it for the video. Here is the finished product and how I present it. I don't know if you're going to be able to get a good view from there, but I will insert a picture. Let's give these guys a try. It's been real hard for me not to take some of this and eat them. So all I did was put some marinara sauce in the middle, your choice, whatever your family likes, or hot sauce, ranch dressing, whatever you like. Mmm. Mmm. These are good. Mm-hmm. you were able to see the inside of one of these they are so good and crunchy and real easy to make guys as you saw they're real simple and if you want to change up the cheeses I mean do whatever your family likes whatever cheese they prefer make it the way they like and this way you're gonna guarantee they're gonna eat them and they're very good again everything will be listed below take a look there don't forget give the video a thumbs up and I'll see you on the next one talk to y'all later bye